Temperatures will be significantly warmer this morning than the past couple of days, but this trend is going to last much longer. I'm um, UF forecaster Anthony Bordenaro. After sunset tonight, temperatures will be tailing off only into the mid to lower 50s. It's a little bit warmer than the past couple of days, but still maybe a little bit chilly. You still may, may want to bring out something light as you head out the door tomorrow morning. That's because I'm expecting a little bit more cloud cover. Overall, the majority of our area will see the mid to lower 50s, getting to 55 in Ocala, 53 in Bronson, 53 in Gainesville, 52 in Ice Springs, 52 up in Lake City, and a little bit warmer as you head towards the first coast. And then as we work our way into the afternoon hours, slightly warmer than today, getting into the mid 70s, 74 in Gainesville, 74 in Brooker, 75 in Micanopy. We'll see a little bit more cloud cover than today, but overall fairly pleasant. These nice southerly winds bringing in these warm conditions. 76 in Bellevue, 76 in Ocala, and 75 in Fort McCoy. And then like I hinted at earlier, we're going to get some cooler weather. December is going to return, and here's why I'm expecting that. So another front is going to be approaching around lunchtime. The majority of our area will be dry. Actually, I'm expecting dry conditions. Then after sunset, the front's going to be inching towards our area, bringing showers towards I-4, and also some sprinkles towards uh, Gilchrist County and the Suwannee River Valley, making its way through by midnight. So you may be asleep at this point. This front won't be as strong as the last front. There's some down trees with this, but this should be a clear passage, again, with some rain. And as you wake up on Saturday, skies will be clearing and cooler temperatures will be on the way. And that's reflected on my six day updated forecast. Notice behind the front, temperatures return to the lower 60s for your afternoon highs and lower 40s for your nighttime lows.